In this video, I would like to discuss a little bit of current events and say a special thank you to the great nation of Ireland. Now, for many, many years, some people don't know this, but I've dreamed of traveling to Ireland and going all over the country, whether it be Killarney or Galloway Bay or Dublin or uh, Kildare, all these wonderful places I'd like to visit them. Well, Ireland made the news the other day and um, Stephen Anderson has the dubious distinction of being the first person banished under a 20-year-old law that was made back in 1999 to keep troublemakers out of the country. And so therefore he will go down in history as being the first person ever banished under this law. Now, Stephen Anderson has got himself banished from quite a number of countries uh, because he is a uh, He's a uh, very unchristian, and he doesn't really give the true gospel because it's tainted with Calvinism. Uh, there are certain groups that can't be saved. Um, he's really big on hating the Jews. Uh, I've listened to some of his rants, and they're just nauseating. So I would like to thank the great nation of Ireland for showing great common sense and wisdom and banishing Stephen Anderson from coming to your country. I know a few others have done the same. I believe South Africa did. But um, unfortunately, we're stuck with them and we can't get rid of them. So if it was up to me, I'd put them on a ship in the middle of the ocean and it'd be kind of like that story called The Man With No Country where they, he just stays on a ship his whole rest of his life, banished from any country. But alas, we can't do that. However, though, um, the great nation of Ireland has, has uh, shown wisdom and prudence in banishing him from their shores. And I remember a long time ago, I made a video on my very first channel. I was dealing with Ruckmanism. And I remember apologizing to uh, the nation of Great Britain and, you know, how, how America let Ruckmanism get off the shores of America and infect other places. It's a terrible scourge, really. Um, but to the people of Ireland, please don't think that, that that's really what true Christianity is about. Um, he does not show any grace. Stephen Anderson is very graceless, um, loud-mouthed, and... Uh, full of anger and rage and um, he is not an exemplary person to hold up when it comes to finding an example for true Christianity uh, meekness and gentleness and such and to have the dubious uh, the, the dubious Instinction? I forgot the word now. <laughs> Distinction. That's the word I'm looking for. <laughs> Should be extinction, perhaps. But anyways, to have the distinction of being the first person banished from a country in a law that's 20 years old, passed in 1999, uh, that's just incredible. And apparently it garnered 14,000 signatures or more. And so... His scheduled trip for May 26th was canceled as he would not be allowed to enter into the country. And I think that is a wise course of action. So, anyways, just once again, I'd like to say thank you to the Irish people. And I pray that someday I'll be able to visit your shores and see all those wonderful places I've seen in documentaries. The Shannon River. Kildare, and all of those places. But, until then, I guess I'll just keep watching the documentaries. So until next time, God bless you all and take care.